round. This is Bancho Sushi Place, huh? Hmm. Miss Yoshi. I came by because I heard this place is getting popular on Cooksta. You have zero followers. The name gave me pause, but to think it's really your place. New food using never before seen ingredients. Can't taste this anywhere else. A taciturn but masculine chef. Wow, did they mention me too? Not really. In any case, what brings you all the way here, Miss Yoshi? Oh, various reasons. I wanted to check out the restaurant. Looks like you're still the same. Well, there is nothing to change. I simply continue on day by day training myself. My goodness, that is the problem. You refused to listen to me last time in a similar fashion and that's what got you booted from the hotel. You're talking about that again? That's the customer's fault for judging the food without even trying. And how long will you continue treating customers this way to keep making that terrible food? What do you mean terrible? Whole roasted charquette is an excellent dish. Shark has been used to cuisine and the decree of ancient rituals. I've been having a great time with Dave the Diver so far. I'm gonna say like one thing. And I, I, I say this with some judgment, but I do wanna say, We've been introducing new mechanics every single day. They need like a day where it's just like, just do the shit that you learned. Just do that. Do like four days in the restaurant where you get to cook and you get into the loop. Don't introduce any characters, any apps, anything like that. And then just just let me settle into the vibe of it a little bit. Is my That's my personal take. And I know it's a me problem and I know not everybody agrees. And I know... Um, a lot of people, they only get a small amount of allowance from their parents, so they need to maximize their value. They need to purchase games that are 400 hours long, even though what they actually do is purchase a game that's 20 hours long, play it and beat it and say that was my favorite game ever, but then actually through the investment of their time, play 575 games of, of League of Legends annually. Um, sometimes special customers with a backstory will hear of the sushi bar and visit. Learn dishes that the customers want through research and serve them to customers. You can now research new recipes. Use the artisan's flame to expand your menu. Whole roasted shark head. The head of a white reef shark that's been deep fried whole. Not based, but the game requires it of me. $53, 65 yums, <laughs> and five chopsticks. Okay, hold on. We need to go menu. No, we need to go ingredients. No, we need to go menu. They are managed, whatever that means. <laughs> I don't know. Hold on, we didn't we just, I guess we got, we got, fish in our freezer. Is this enough? This seems good. I mean, it, it worked well yesterday. Maybe we could take this off the menu. Because it's like, the, these are, are cheap. We must have gotten some better food like while we were down there. Like, look at this. Look at this red tooth trigger fish. Holy cow. We can add six of those to the menu? Dude, it's going to be a big day. We can add six of those or after enhancing, we could add three of those but they will generate slightly, much more yum. You know what? We're not like a McDonald's out here. I don't think we need to be serving, you know, people in, in such a, a fast fashion. Instead, we can just, we can focus on serving good food. Here's what I will say though. Blue Tang Sushi, it, it only has, uh, there's only one portion. Can I delete that for now and then add a different food that only has one portion? Okay, never mind. Let's add this one. It has maximum yum. Go ahead. Okay, I'm, I'm ready to start my day. Fast fashion, pretty bad in general. It blew my mind uh, the other day. I didn't put the shark head on the menu. Are we gonna lose? <laughs> it blew my mind the uh, well this is probably like six months ago i was at uh the pacific center mall in vancouver british columbia i walked by h&m we don't have we don't have it okay we don't we don't have it we don't have it now i've, I've purchased some things from h&m before uh, in my life this one blew me away. It said four kids t-shirts for $20.
That's like the price you pay in New York City to get like, I love New York shirts that I don't even want to know how they're made. That's scary to me. Thank you for the money, by the way. Yeah, I don't know if they're printed on Kleenex or what. I'm sure they're, they're garbage quality, but the price was crazy. Thanks, Bancho Sushi Bar, for you. Amazing. How many followers we got now? We got to get to 10. We have five. <laughs> Come on. How many did you buy? None, dude. Six followers. Dude, the graph is a hockey stick. It's going crazy. You've earned Artisan's Flame. $87. Six followers, plus six followers. That's like my Twitch stream summary after I play four hours of uh, Midnight Suns. Let me take a look at Eye Diver briefly. I would like to be able to carry more cargo. That, that seems like a viable purchase for me right now. I don't think we need to dive any deeper yet, but I, or have more oxygen. We do want to find this Sea People artifact. We also need to kill a shark at some point. I'm not a Midnight Suns disrespecter. I'm a Midnight Suns respecter. I just don't respect what my analytics look like after I have respected. Blue seashell. Okay. Can we kill a jellyfish? Enhanced harpoon tip. Some wood. I've been stung by a jellyfish. And I didn't even see it coming. It's Minecraft now. We are mining. Copper ore. Holy cow. It, it is, actually is Minecraft. We do run a sushi restaurant, so at some point we may want to get some fish. Although we, uh, no, actually we did not have a lot in reserve now that I think about it. What do you mean Midnight Suns is a mobile game that convinced you to pay real game prices for? It's not a mobile game in the slightest. Look at this big boy right here. Start him off with one of these. He's weak. He's weak. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> that, that didn't feel good, but it's gonna taste good on the plate. Okay, tab it out here. Because I think he's ready to go. I, that was just my guess. My guess was that you're ready to go. The lionfish! He, he ate me! Get bashed. Get bashed. Now you belong to me. Get bashed. Bashed. Bashed? Holy cow, this guy's strong. It finally happened. All your fish are belong to us. What's the... Oh, there we go. Green humphead parrotfish. Dude! He's so lootable! I'm not even reading it. It seems to shoot lightning, though. That seems pretty good. Um, all right. This game's got some crunchy mechanics. I dig that. I'm into it. Excuse me? Blowfish? <laughs> oh, you think you're, you're real slick, huh? Well, let's see how slick you are now that I got QP mayonnaise. The internet's most overrated, but also pretty delicious condiment, admittedly. He's not ready yet. I know, I know. I know. 
This is what separates me from the other divers, okay? I'm willing to do what they're not willing to do. Just call me the Tom Cruise of getting the bends. Okay, I'm out of here. We could have stayed longer. That that burns me up a little bit, but Have you seen the menu? I want to see it. It's on my list of things I want to see, but probably never will. So instead, I just keep reading the Wikipedia synopses for all these movies that I'll probably never see. You guys ever seen Francis, huh? Me neither. I know every story beat, though. Hey, I did... <laughs> I can't believe I hadn't mentioned this yet. While uh, shaving on Friday, I think, um, I watched 35, 40 minutes of White Noise, the new Noah Bombatch movie featuring Adam Driver, Greta Gerwig, Don Cheadle, Andre 3000. It's a star-studded cast. I don't think in my life I have ever... It's been a long time since I have hated a movie as much as I hated this. I know that it, a lot of, like, because I went to, as soon as I, I, let me put it this way. I got 40 minutes in, and then I said, I'm not finishing this. So I wikipedia the synopsis of what happens in the story and went, okay. And then I went to IMDb, figuring that this was going to be, like, one of the most hated movies of the year. And uh, it has, like, a 6.2 or something like that, which is actually respectable. I hated every second of watching it. I hated the way the people talked. It was like if somebody saw a Yorgos Lanthimos film and tried to copy it, but without having any of the panache. You were pogging from I'm thinking of ending things? No, not true. Um, I, I, I'm thinking of ending things. I, I'm, to be honest with you, I think that I probably hate that movie more than White Noise because I watched the whole thing. I'm thinking of ending things made me want to, uh, it made me want to stop watching movies forever. That movie's fucking sick. I'm sorry, I didn't take a film studies class. I never built up a, a callus for watching boring content, uh, by sitting in a, a crowded auditorium and watching the film Wavelength where it starts with a zoomed-in shot of somebody's apartment door, spends 22 minutes zooming out, slightly pans to the right, and then zooms back in on another part of the apartment. You've made this joke before? Yeah? I've also seen the movie White Noise before. It was called I'm Thinking of Ending Things. Do you know a lot about this giant blue hole? Mm. Well, I'm not sure what to say to that. It's different in there every time. Yes, that's it. It's the best place to collect Marinka. I could complete my collection in this place. Marinka? Don't tell me that you don't know the highly popular ocean life trading cards. Marinka? How can you not have heard of the futuristic trading cards that utilize an AI recognition system that automatically corresponds to fish in real life? Um, never heard of them. It sounds fun, though. Sai, you seem quite behind the times. Let me help you install the app. That's fine. Maybe I'll... Maybe I'll catch the cards. Maybe I won't catch the cards. You can get fancier cards for catching higher-grade fish. You can automatically acquire marine cards. Sure, why not? Why not? Um, we can head back down, right? It's, it's the afternoon. Thank you for reminding me of that awful movie. There are dozens of us who enjoy intellectual movies, but also would prefer if they had some entertainment value as well. Don't even get me started. Three most hated movies I've seen in the last, uh, I don't know, probably five years. White Noise is definitely up there. Um, I'm Thinking of Ending Things is the second for sure. 
a machete, a katana. The, the third is High Life, the science fiction movie also featuring Andre 3000 but, and Robert Pattinson that seems to delight in boring the viewer. Have you seen Margin Call, though? Now that is a movie, dude. Margin Call, that's a fucking movie. Okay, I think, I, I'm hoping we have enough fish. Take me down low enough that maybe we can finally find the sea people. I'm on a sea people diet. I see people, I eat them. One second, get blasted. As the easiest kill of my life. Why am I? I don't know why I'm chasing after this guy again. I should just. I should. I should complete the the quest instead. But that's not what I'm doing. I'm doing different things with my actions. I need to get down to 70 meters. We got a long way to go. Ah! You asked for it. Like, you literally asked for it. I can't take your opinion seriously because you cried during Black Panther. You seem to be taking my opinion because you're here watching the stream. Three years, four years, five years after that anecdote first took place. So you seem to be willfully taking my opinion seriously for whatever reason. I'm not saying you should. But you're here nonetheless. Okay, give me this O2. I'm staying down here all damn day. So you didn't cry? No, I did, but like the older you get, I mean, let me put it this way. You're gonna start crying like all the time. The older you get, the more you're gonna cry. It's just the way of the world, man. You start to cry at, you know, sentimental advertisements. See people artifact? Come back to the boat safely, I'll be waiting. I only cry in good movies? That's gonna change. Wait until you reach, like, you know, age 34, and then you see the end of Hot Tub Time Machine. You could, there, There's so many movies I've seen where, uh, while watching it, I was like, this shit is bad and boring. And then at the end, they play, like, Once in a Lifetime or something like that and do, like, a, a montage of someone getting their life together. And I'm like, I mean, I still hate this shit, but I'm crying for sure. Like, it's so inspiring. I cried during that movie about the St. Louis Rams quarterback. The, you cried during the Kurt Warner movie? I haven't seen that. And I, in all likelihood, I never will. But I, that's an inspiring story, right? Nobody, nobody thought he could do it, man. And then miraculously, he gets a call from... Uh, who, uh, Mike McCarthy? Hold on, I, I, I knew this at one point. Don't ink me. You don't ink me, I'll freaking ink you. Okay, we have way too much stuff. The football coach? Yes, yes, the football coach. Because we were talking about Kurt Warner, the football player. Perfect. Drop the lead? No, I, I don't, ah! No, I don't think I will. And now cried at Avatar? I have not seen Avatar yet. One day. It was Dick Vermeil. Sorry, Dick Vermeil, former Kansas City Chiefs coach. The new one? I haven't seen the new one. I haven't seen the old one. I haven't seen the prequel, also known as the first Airbender. I haven't seen the last Airbender. I haven't seen the M. Night Shyamalan uh, debasement of the franchise. I've never seen any film with Avatar in its, in its title. 
and I believe that that's true. I am a little familiar with Ultima 7, the Shroud of the Avatar, but that's it. Mike Martz! Mike Martz, that was his name? Weren't you vibing the new movies in 2009? Yeah, that was during a period where I went to the theater to see like a lot of movies by myself. But to be honest, what happened, and I, I apologize because people have definitely heard this story before. Avatar came out like Christmas 2009-ish. Um, and all of my friends and housemates went home to their ancestral homes, largely in the greater Toronto area. They all saw Avatar independently. And when they came back, they were like, you gotta see it, it's such an experience. And I was like, do you wanna go see it with me? And they're like, no, not really, I already saw it. By the way, you absolutely, 100%, you have to see it in the theater. You have to see it in the theater. So I procrastinated, didn't see it in the theater, and then the shit, was not in the theater anymore. And I was like, I guess I'm never gonna see it. Cause they said uh, the only, you will never be able to have an experience like seeing this movie in the theater. As soon as it came out on DVD, I was like, well, I guess I missed my window. And just like that, exactly, 13 years go by. A million little nights and days go by. You had six months? Bro, are you James Cameron? Well, you so pressed one person hasn't seen Avatar. It is crazy. Someone posted like a, a, it was, I don't know what, just a graphic. It's not like an infographic, but it was like, here's all the movies that have ever made over $1 billion. Which one is the most surprising? And honestly, looking at all of them, I gotta say, I still think it's Avatar 1. Avatar 2 making over a billion is not that surprising because Avatar 1 made so much money. But the first Avatar becoming like the highest grossing movie of all time is a crazy story. Because like, <laughs> I didn't know anybody who was excited for the movie at all. And then like a year after it came out, I feel like I've not heard anybody talking about it until the sequel came. I mean, we had like seven years of James Cameron making the sequels and people being like, we don't want this. And then the sequel came out, it had a billion dollars. Yet it, it, it crossed a billion dollars like silently. Anyway, I'm not anti-Avatar, I've just, I've, I've never seen it. All the other movies that have made a billion dollars made like perfect sense. The live action remake of like The Lion King, the live action remake of Aladdin, um, like seven Marvel movies, Top Gun Maverick, it all, those all made sense to me. Avatar 1 seems like a crazy underdog story. Frozen, Titanic. Anyway, open Bancho Sushi. I did, there are no items on the menu. I'd like to restart. Hold on, can I? <laughs> can I put some items on the menu then? Enhancing and. Enhancing end. How much does this cost us? Holy cow. I mean, this is this is top tier. Let's do it. Place it on the menu. Max me out. Place me on the menu and max me out. Play we got to do some serious fishing. We're not serving enough customers daily, and is my opinion. We don't have a shark yet, okay? If you could just relax. Who wants tea? None tea. You want some tea. Okay, you can have some tea. She is waiting on that shark head. Yeah, I hope she's like at least eating like a, a heavy lunch, man. Perfect? That looks perfect to me. Twitch is a little bit broken. I mean, honestly, like... <laughs> Listen, I hope you guys enjoyed the internet, like, while it was... at its peak. I really do feel like... I can't say this specifically with respect to Twitch. I do feel like the internet's gotten, like, a lot worse in the past maybe two, three years.
every website has been rolled up into like one of five companies. And, uh, oh, excuse me, what is this? Left mouse and right mouse? What happened? <laughs> I was clicking, oh, we reached bronze, okay. Hold on, we had to clean that. Somebody made a mess. Yeah, like software's gotten slower since computers have gotten faster. Chrome has, has never been worse than it is right now until tomorrow. I'm gonna make it, just chill out, okay? And then we're we're entering like um tighter economic conditions, right? Like this is how things worked essentially at the tail end of a period of generationally low interest and cheap debt. People were companies like uh Facebook would just be like, you know, hiring people just to just to hire them. I don't know, I can't really speak to that. I've never worked in the industry, but it felt it felt good to say. <laughs> I'm not saying everything used to be better. But definitely, like, I feel like tech used to be, like, you know, faster. At least, or, like, you have better uptime. There was also a period of, like, um... I mean, like, in 2008, like, shit just did not work some of the time. But there was, like, a golden period from, like, 2015 to, like, 2019, where I was like, shit's working pretty good right now. We are, like, legit living in the future. Yeah, 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 yeah. What do you need? Signal from the sea people. Follow this signal's location. Serve whole roasted shark head. Modern internet has also ruined my attention span. Honestly, one of the great things about having a kid is that I think it is really... It's brought me back to, like... Like, my brain is back in the 90s. I spend so much of, like, every day... Having to use my imagination. You know, driving... Uh, uh, a, a Peppa Pig train over a Lego train track, crashing into like a crowd of Pokemon and stuff like that, reading a bunch of like children's books, making up rules for new games and stuff like that. I've definitely, okay, so I gotta follow the dolphin real quick. I've undone uh, a lot of the, the like TikTok damage to my brain in the last like year and a half for sure. You gotta stop getting caught in these nets, man. I'm sorry. I, like, one day I might not be here, okay? I gotta press space on the top, maybe? Left click. Oh, okay, holy cow is gonna... What the heck just hit me? They're shooting at me! It's not fair! You could kill a man! Get saved. How come shark head is okay, but dolphin isn't? Here, all I was... In, in, I, I get that you're saying within the rules of the game. Why is that okay? But honestly, like... Um, I think in real life, shark head is also not okay. We gotta be nicer to the sharks. If anything, we should be eating, like, more pigeons. There's too many. Oh, they left another gift. Large gold bar! Holy cow. Okay, we need to catch some fish today. Not every fish has to be, you know, incredible. Hello, hello. Okay, you want a, you want a piece? Why not take the whole thing? It's dark and darker combat. Get smoked. Be picking lead out of your flesh. How do you reconcile being nicer to sharks with spending your weekend at the aquarium? 
I don't know, the shark at the aquarium seems pretty good. Just in general, like the Vancouver Aquarium is all about, you know, sustainability. They got rid of the cetaceans, man. They got no cetaceans anymore. I don't even think they have an octopus anymore. I think octopuses, they, they're like on the vanguard of being too smart to have in captivity anymore. My impression of the Vancouver Aquarium, um, cetacean needed. So true, so true. That's a black pepper. Now that's, uh, that's a classic right there. Triple axle. Sure, why not? Bro, chill. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna get you. Go ahead, make my day. It's that easy. Underwater scooter. We're Subnautica now. Double kill, two quick ones. Hippos are cetaceans. They ain't got any hippos either, honestly. I know we're like overloaded here, but I feel like we should just farm. Ah, metal bullets! Oh, <laughs> get smoked, dude. He's going down. Can't believe it's happening in my hometown. You did a Subnautica playthrough, right? I should go back and watch that? Nah. It's fine, like... What are you? You like a weird shrimp? It's not top tier content. I'm not, I'm not your Subnautica guy. It's a big shark. I know we have to get a shark, but like... There's no way we're making it, man. We're doing, we, like, we just, we, we can't kill it. Not to mention I can't catch it because my inventory is totally full. What content are you proud of? I don't know, man. Like, I'm, t I'm too old for this conversation. I'm sorry. Like, I'm just... <laughs> I picture myself more like... There's no ambition behind what I do. There's routine, and I think in that, there's some nobility. You know, not everything needs... Like, I, I am reaching a point for sure where, like, I hear content creators talk so highly about, like, the stuff that they make. And they're like, it's all about trying out new ideas. And then, you know, I want to be on the cutting edge of YouTube content. And then you look at their thumbnail, and the thumbnail is, like, letting chat choose what I put in my ass. And I'm like, it's not that they're wrong. It's just that I guess I'm in a different mindset. I, I consider myself less like I'm making... Um, you know, like once in a lifetime content and more like, I'm like car talk, you know, I'm like an NPR podcast that's been on the, the air for like 40 years. You wouldn't go to the car talk guy and be like, what's your favorite episode of car talk? Oh, it's the one where we taught them how to fix the vapor lock in their Pontiac Sunfire. You're just like, no, it's just a comfortable thing to have on while you're, uh, while you're driving or something like that, you know? That's, I've, I think I've, I've acknowledged my place. Yeah, I consider myself like maybe the spiritual successor of the Blue Collar Comedy Tour. One of my favorite, uh, one of my favorite ensemble of stand-up comedy films. The original Kings of Comedy has also got to be up there. I acknowledge that I'm I'm something in the background while you work, and that's fine. Because that's how I use Twitch too. Okay, what what's our mission? We could follow the signal. We caught a lot of fish. We could follow the signal. I'm a friend of the fish today. And if we get a shark, we could kill the shark. Harpoon damage, 60% chance of paralysis. Okay. Might as well. I'm 
suddenly remembering how big Jeff Foxworthy was. I mean, when you're the best in the business, you, you reap the rewards. You're the best the business has ever seen. Sorry, I didn't mean to insult him. The best the business has ever seen. I can't, I can't go this low. Damn, baby, I can't go this low, but I know someone who can. I'm gonna die of oxygen poisoning? Don't go that way. He, he literally can't. Yo, this guy, he's mad though. Ah! <laughs> sorry, sorry. He's paralyzed. Get him. Get him. Go off. We're going off. You fool. Oh, hey, D, hey, D, hey, D, hey, Barracuda. Hush dart. The non-lethal tranquilizer hush dart. Successfully tranquilized fish can be sold expensively, you might say. He's not he's not tranquilized. It's so sad he's running away. Smack him. Tranquilize him. Smack him. Tranquilize him. I'm out of I'm out of bullets. He's too good. He's unstoppable. Oh, you woke him up. It takes him eight seconds to pass out. He's too fast. Will you ink to me? I'm gonna die now, you jerk. Thanks for nothing. I got owned by a little fish today. And I didn't even see it coming. I'm not getting that. I, I, I don't think I got the... I don't have the real estate. Joel says GG. Joel sends his regards. I'm taking one of you with me. Really? Get smoked. Oh no, this guy's gonna kill me. I can't get the oxygen because it takes like five seconds to get the oxygen. Just try, try, try. 80, 80. I, I can do this, I can do this. I can spend another day in the ocean. And that, that fish must have fallen asleep, right? So we can take him and sell him for mucho dollars. Just go up, bro. I can. I, look at. I got three kilos of space left. One of the greatest plays of all time. Okay, watch this. By the way, I'm happy to report. I was saying that um, I was looking at Peloton's list of um, top songs from 2022 and I didn't recognize a single one that is incorrect actually having looked at the list again I I recognize one song from 2022 about damn time by Lizzo turn up the music turn down the lights I've got a feeling I'm gonna be all right okay it's about darn time I know that one shark me Sleep. He's sleeping. He's not sleeping. He's not. He's not because he's not a normal fish. You asked for it. Didn't Lizzo get canceled for being a landlord? Who cares? The song goes hard. I would say that song goes hard enough for her to own three houses. I'm dead. I'm dead. It's n it, we can't make it. We ca uh, game over. <laughs> you always gotta watch your oxygen. We can only retrieve one item, dude. Give me the give me the three piece here. 
Oh man. Dave, the giant blue hole looks infinitely more dangerous. Always pay attention to your oxygen. Bro, a shark tried to kill me. It's not my fault. There's nothing I could do. It sounded like he was walking on concrete, but actually he was walking on carpet. What am I supposed to do? Five hundred and sixty gold. Yeah, I guess we should get some upgrades. That's a good point. Let's see though. What do we got here? What do we got? Kajime mixed with black vinegar. The sour and bitter flavor will refresh your palate. Tokoroten made with agar mixed with soy sauce. A cool low calorie dish that's good for your health. I'm gonna let's let's get some seasoned kajime. Let's get them all. <laughs> NL, do you plan on watching Kaleidoscope, the new Netflix show that you can watch in any order? If they have not canceled it in six months, perhaps I will watch it. I am now treating Netflix with kid gloves. I will never be excited about a, a new show ever again. I'm just gonna go back to watching Frasier. I already know they didn't cancel it. Holy cow, this thing is... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Yes. Enhance has been completed. The red-toothed triggerfish sushi. Let's add that to the... Uh, wait, wait, you know what? Let's add that... Let's enhance it one more time before we add it to the menu. <laughs> I saw a chat like this once. Centuries ago. Hey, we added it to the menu. Now we only got one piece. I'm a fool. How much does it cost us to enhance? Whatever. I'll, I'll, I'll upgrade it one time. I think I got to strike a better balance. I keep making sushi too good. So then there's not enough of it. To, to go around. We're back, but we got no badges. That's fine. It's not a big deal. It's Everything's okay. I got a feeling I'm going to be all right. Okay. It's about damn time. Words to live by from Lizzo. What do we need to upgrade to the next level? How is this game? Dan, I didn't recognize you with no badges. It's actually, it's really good. I will say, let me just see what I need to rank up here. I need to receive 20 followers. It's not possible. Um, I will say, I'm about an hour and 45 minutes in. We're still getting dialogue and tutorials. But the actual gameplay is, is a lot of fun. I can open the restaurant now. So it's kind of like Midnight Suns after 100 hours. Okay, plus two, plus two. Twitch messed up for anyone else? I don't know, maybe read chat for like half of one second. <laughs> I'm sorry. My New Year's resolution was not to be nicer. It was it was to tell it like it is even more often. And and you're the victim for that, but... I know you want some tea, but I'm gonna end up just one man. Who gets this? You get this. Who gets this? You get this. Go ahead, be as annoyed as you want to be. We, it's you know, it's a it's a tough restaurant here. We don't we don't have a lot of staff. We gotta hire some staff. She's getting mad. She's getting mad. She's getting. There we go. I need the noodles. The noodles. And then they, they will not wait for the tea. They need the tea like yesterday. Holy cow, we're making a lot of money though. That's perfect, that's perfect. Forty-five bucks for tea? 
Yeah, it's Hawaii. We're in Hawaii right now. Okay, what a perfect day. Close for the day. We got nine new followers. Look, look at this graph, man. I would have thought we would have gotten more than nine followers today. Net profit of 257. Hold on, I see badges again. It, it happened. Badges have returned. At least some badges. Hey, you haven't quit diving yet, have you? I, Ellie, I died yesterday. I perished, I ran out of oxygen under the surface of the ocean and was saved by the charitable act of a, of a friend. Um, I'm doing some investigating for an important paper. I'm gonna need some help. Give me three blue shells. Give me, give me three shells. Give me three shells, mister. Give me three shells towards the door. As Lizzo said, it's about damn time. That is true. She was talking about badges. Turn up the badges. I, I will say, if I were Lizzo, here's how I'd write the song. I would say, turn down the music. Turn up the lights. I got a feeling... It's gonna be an early night, okay. It's about bedtime. That could work, that could work. Plus two, plus two, minus two, there it's an even split. Was it blue shells and brown shells? Yes, it was. I, today's goal for me, let's spend some money and let's, let's kill that shark. I would like to craft a triple axle. Thank you. And I would like to buy some upgrades for myself. I would like my harpoon gun to deal almost four times more damage. <laughs> That's my friend Dave. You don't want to get killed by his harpoon. It traps the souls of its fishes. I would also like to upgrade my diving suit. I would like to upgrade my air tank first. My diving suit should be okay. It, uh, you know what? I'm going to upgrade my cargo box too. I keep, uh, I keep running out of cargo because I don't know what loot is good and what loot is bad, so I never know what to prioritize. She said, and I quote, Do you speak of my language? End quote. And according to Herodotus, he just smiled and gave me a Vegemite sandwich. What is this? Oh, a brown seashell already. So true, so true. Oh, man. Shock harpoon tip level two. I'd say we take those. I heard a bit like this once, centuries ago. Dude, I the time has come. The blowfish, you've been living too easy on this planet, okay? We're serving blowfish sushi. For the Whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> I hate this. I hate this guy! But now, I ate this guy. Phrasing. 13 damage katana. Don't need the bullets yet, but we're gonna in just a second, because check this out. Yeah, go ahead. A little closer. <laughs> oh, you dumbass. <laughs> I own you. I own you. No shot. Oh, you too? You want a, You want one too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're approaching me? Hey! Oh, no! He's one-tapped?
I see it, it's okay. Where's my shark at? Whatever happened to Basement Jacks? Where's my shark at? at, 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 at? Don't let the shark cave in on you. Don't let the shark cave in on you. Oh. Well, welcome, Barracuda. I think we want to keep our existing gun, even though this would give us a new uh, blueprint. They got replaced by Fat Boy Slim? I thought they were contemporaries of one another! I thought they were contemporaneous! Yeah, go ahead. Oh, Jesus. Oh, you don't take damage on your saw? Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead again. <laughs> I should have I should have stuck with the shark, man. I'm so freaking stupid. Oh. All you had to do was follow the dang shark, Dave. It's fine. Yeah, send it to the fish tank. That's fine. What do we got? We got a we got a we still got the triple axle. That's pretty good. I can live with that. Around the world, around the world. So true. Me when I do uh Robin R Zone's 20 minute Daft Punk core strength class. Me booting up a Peloton class. Hearing hello, a smile on my face. Next word, hustlers, immediate cringe. What's up, hustlers? I'm not Robin our zone. I'm sorry, I'm not a hustler. I'm just a guy. Literally just a dude. Just trying to get some ab work in. Basic underwater rifle, no thank you. So as a YouTube Andy who hasn't been around for over a year, what happened to the Isaac runs? Here's a better question for you. It's more of a question about the human psyche. You obviously stopped watching because, you know, something else demanded your time. Probably a superior form of entertainment. You're really... Who, who are you, you piece, to come into my stream and say, Hey, what happened to that content that made me uh, get bored with you in the first place? Ask, ask yourself, I guess, what I'm trying to say is, I, I ask yourself why you care. Obviously, if you were into it, you wouldn't have taken a, a year hiatus. All right, good point. I love the Attitude Era. What if he had work? Quit your job. <laughs> Quit your job to watch me stream. I was in a coma. No, you weren't. That shit only happens in Sandra Bullock movies. Like, you could be in a coma, but not for a whole year, right? What's that? Oh, you're dead. Sorry. What's the average coma length? It's probably like two weeks. 19 years? What? Hang on. I'm looting vinegar. His daycare worker was off. Now that I can respect. Oxygen 50? Ooh. What is this? Is this the signal? Is this my seashell? Hey, could you leave me alone for three seconds? Okay, well you're 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 really cruising for a bruise in here, brother. That one's on you. And honestly, you know what? I was gonna leave your body, then I decided that's not the kind of person I wanna be. Instead I will consume your flesh to gain your strength. Underwater scooter. More O2. Can I go down this? How, how deep can I go now? 
Sorry, the term is how low can you go? You can go down into the limestone caves. What is this? Uh, Kingston, Ontario? Honestly, if I'm in a coma, don't wake me up. I'm doing okay. Let me sleep. I'd be so pissed if this was like a dream. And then you wake me up and like I'm still teaching ESL in South Korea. Oh, man. <laughs> don't wake me up before you go-go. Let me sleep before you go-go. I'm at a critical depth, dude. I got no problem with you. My quarrel is not with you! Wow, so this is the place. Let's see, the signal is coming from inside. There are letters I've never seen before written on the pillar, centuries ago. If we had a tool of some sort, we could move aside that pile of rocks and try going inside. I think it would be best to talk this over with Cobra. Come on up for now. Okay, thanks, my ass is being eaten right now. Meanwhile, everyone's trying to play Tunic in the background. I thought I heard something centuries ago. Run. I'm using my loot. He's falling asleep. He's falling asleep. And she's calling a cab while she's having a smoke and she's taking a cab. Tennis racket. Excuse me, how do I use my, my submersible? Shift. That's damn true. You're absolutely not wrong. Okay, quick, quick loot. Uh-oh. You're sleepy. Piece of crap. I want that squid. Ooh. No, you're running out of air. All your cuttlefish are belong to us. <laughs> I'm getting pretty good with this one, dude. Hey, forget the restaurant. I'm going to open my own damn aquarium. Greed is good. Uh-oh, Inky. Stop. Oh, never mind. Call me. If I just complete the delivery to Eco Watcher, ta-da, ha-ha, research level gained, huh? Eco Watcher, it's a mission-based app made to protect the environment. It pays out with Eco Coin. It pays a 93% APR. Unfortunately, it's denominated in EcoCoin, which has recently been completely absconded with by the founder. But honestly, fortunes are made in the bear market. You get points for completing missions on the app and get rewards for reaching certain levels. So this was for points on an app, not for a paper? Uh, well, you could say they're basically the same thing. You try it out too if you're interested. See you. Use the Eco Watcher app to check on various ecological missions. Gather points to receive rewards. Stop calling me. I found a place with a signal from the sea people. I can't hold back my academic thirst to check it out. I'm at an important symposium right now. Please talk it over with Cobra first. Huh? How to get rid of rock piles. You'll have to use a bomb, of course. Okay, okay, this, this is what I mean. It's just a little bit... It's, it's too mechanic dense, but that's okay. I'm having a great time. Now we can make hush darts, too, but you gotta have enough green humphead parrot fishes to make a... And you gotta... And you got the vinegar, and now we gotta go back and cook Jesse, and... I would like to go to the sushi restaurant. Hold on, I'm just enjoying a, a brief rest.
I'm detoxing from the new mechanics. I'm figuring out if I need to go to the bathroom right now or if I'm going to wait until the next at the next pivot point. Let's let's wait. Maybe I'll just sit, uh, break down the urine that's already in my bladder and uh No, that's stupid. I'll be right back. <laughs> this is my New Year's resolution. New New Year's resolution. When you have to go piss, go piss. Call this Dave the Diver 1 and I'll be back in uh in 2 minutes. See you soon. <laughs>